rock roofing. So you you uh, saving two hundred fifty to five hundred dollars per job, just from this little what is it like? 400 square feet? Oh, I don't even think it's 400 square feet, maybe 300, but I even step on them, increase them. Wow. And then when you unroll them. That's impressive demonstration right there. And then when you unroll them, you can look right here and it's not even broken. This one right here, yeah. where does it take them? To right an here. online submission form. So, you know, you have the small amount of nails on there. Got a bucket or wherever you want to dump them on, and just everything falls off, you got a clean patch. You know, the, the good thing about your underlayment is that it installs both ways, so the logo is always up. Three, 500 bucks per job savings right here. Yeah, you know, we stock the silicone, we have a safety uh, first aid kit, we have a fire extinguisher. Little Rock Roofing. We're Little Rock, Arkansas, man. What are you guys famous for? What, what, what to do here? Like in the middle of nowhere, it took me like <laughs> six hours to get three flight delays, one uh, cancel. So what's in Arkansas? Oh, the Arkansas Razorbacks, if you're a Razorback fan, and uh, a lot of state parks. Uh, one of the only naturally occurring place for diamonds. But other than that, Little Rock's a, a small big town, so not much to it. So Arkansas uh, Roofing Association, is that a pretty new? That's brand new. We're in our infancy of starting that, so it's yeah. brand new. Association, but it's not licensing, right? No, it's not licensing, but we're hoping to have more strict licensing to elevate roofing in Arkansas. Good morning, guys. Good morning. How are you? Good morning. How are you? So this is our small office, kind of our showroom. So we're uh, certified by for residential malarkey and okay. GAF. Some of our certifications and our licensing, you know, just keep them displayed for people to see. That's the, the new GAF Lifetime boot. You have to buy it in the specific size, mm -hmm. but this gets flashed in and this, this comes over the top. It'll go all the way up to a 12-12 pitch, I believe. 312 to 12,000 and this comes over the top. And when you do it with the GAF system, they'll give you a, a, like a lifetime on the boot. Is this your process? Um, not what, totally. What, what's GF versus Malarkey 8.4? Those are the, the registered warranties this last month. So that's the warranties that we've registered one last month. Adam Benzman book. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Adam's a great guy. But then the good stuff is out here in the warehouse. We wish we had a slightly larger warehouse, but for the most part, here it is. So. Oh wow, very little, but so this is, so you, I see a roof store, look at this. So you have nails. So you, you uh, saving 250 to $500 per job just from this little, what is it, like 400 square feet? Oh, I don't even think it's 400 square feet, maybe 300, but yeah, so we, uh, pipe boots, you know, the three main colors, gray, black, brown, cap nails. How much are the nails right now? Oh, 30, $35, not even $35, maybe less than that. Hmm. Cap nails are like 10 or 11, silicone, and Use then um, we have our extra catch-all system up here. So we have our own branded underlayment, Nice. Um, and then we have the Roofing Insights. The Roofing Insights is a little thicker. We use it on higher pitch stuff. We have uh, extra shingles that we save for because we do a significant amount of repairs. Repairs are very profitable. What's your average repair ticket? 1200 1200 You know, and the cost we have in that is almost nothing. We get good repairs, we get referrals off that, and then we, if we do a good job on the repair, when they're ready for a roof, then we get that phone call. And so. probably a review all the time? Yeah. Roofing inside. You know, the, the good thing about your underlayment is that it installs both ways. So the logo is always up. Yep. So you don't have to walk back to the other end to make sure the logo is up. You know, it's both ways so that guys can lay it faster. Yep. And not have to worry about being it upright or upside down or right side up. Exactly. Catch all system with QR codes, a couple different banners. Talk to me about uh, catch all. Is uh, how hard was it to train your guys to do it? A lot of complaining that we're still pretty... learning that process. You know, actually, we do a lot of the. We help them set it up, and sometimes. We're setting it up the day before the job, 
and it stays up till the day after the job. I so see. essentially we're getting three days of a billboard. So what uh, material goes here? Um, I see. We're doing Malarkey. Uh, Malarkey Highlander. We're doing the new color Weatherwood Plus. What kind of warranty uh, Malarkey does now? Uh, pretty good one. Uh, this The Highlander's class three. Yeah, so it'll be a registered warranty. It won't be the full system, so it'll be everything, the ice and water, the hip and ridge, and the starter, and the field shingle will all be malarkey. And that'll uh, get the emerald warranty. We're registering those on every roof right now. How much does it cost you to dump a trailer here? Pretty inexpensive. Pretty inexpensive. There's a, if we go in this city, um, it can be pretty expensive, but if we go to the next city over and drive another 30 minutes, it's uh, only a hundred, couple hundred dollars. Your roof store. Yeah, that's right. Saving, saving money. Saving two, three hundred dollars per job. Just buying. Owning, owning the cost of our job. You know, job costing is big, and if you can save that money, save it. Malarkey Highlander, next AR. Is it your uh, go-to shingle? Is it your favorite? Definitely our go-to shingle. Have you ever seen anybody roll one of these up? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so like, you know, we'll roll them up. And sh show it. We'll show roll it. them up in front of the customer, and I'll roll up a, a brand that starts with a T and <laughs> compare them. And the customer is just blown away by the, you know, it's not just asphalt in these shingles, you know, so I'll even... I even step on them and crease them. Wow. And then when you unroll them. That's impressive demonstration right there. And then when you unroll them, you can look right here and it's not even broken. I mean, maybe just the slightest, but not even broken in but the you tooth. You were stepping on it when it's rolled, yeah. yeah. But I only weigh 150 pounds. <laughs> the Manco Ridge Vents, Smart Start, Malarkey Starter, and then this, uh, this felt that we get from this Roofing Insights guy. It's a good felt. We've really had a lot of good luck with this felt, good quality, the tear strength. The guys can step on it and not slip, you know, even you guys on like a, it? Yeah, the guys really like it. Even on a 1010 or a 1212, you know, they're really feeling good about the security of stepping on it and not slipping. So Yeah, so we call this our job site trailer. So our job site trailer goes with us to every single job. It's like a moving billboard, has our name and our number on it. Uh, but also it's like a hardware store. So everything that we stock in the warehouse, we also stock inside the trailer. Uh, pipe boots, nails, cap nails, framing nails, saw, framing nail gun, extra rolls of synthetic, toolbox with tools in it, shirts. A little bit of a mess right now catch-all system but this is uh, three five hundred bucks per job savings right here yeah you know we stock the silicone we have a safety uh, first aid kit we have a fire extinguisher um, extra extra magnets extra pipe boots these are the have you seen these magnets yeah yeah they're nice Woo. you like them oh man they will they will pick up everything this is kind of also our repair trailer and so on our repair trailer, a couple specialized tool, Milwaukee. Please make this, Milwaukee. Uh, I know, right? So this is uh, Power Stick Pro, but uh, we can go over there and drive. But it's pretty cool. It has a sleeve that slides on and off. Yeah. But beyond that, it'll pick them up from inches away to where you get the little box magnets. The magnet and those are pretty weak. This magnet is really strong. It works. Yeah, I mean, we will, in our production, you know, use the catch-all system, and the guys will come and pick everything up, but then in the next two days, we kind of have a post inspect. So, you know, you have the small amount of nails on there. You got a bucket or wherever you want to dump them on, then just everything falls off. You got a clean patch. I've Protect seen them at the expo. Yeah, it protects the magnets inside, so this is can wear out. You know, it slides good on concrete. And then with the shape of it, if you have some bushes, you can go in around the bushes and get everything down in the back side of it. This one right here, yeah. where does it take them? To an online submission form. 
on our website so Smart. they can fill it out and contact us if they can't get the number. Do people actually do it? We've had a couple, yeah. Awesome. This underlayment is pretty pretty good. You can come on the valley if you want. I'm good. Good. I can walk on it. <laughs> That's definitely not slippery. No, even with a little bit of dew on it, it performs really well. I like it. I like it a lot. Is it an insurance claim? It is an insurance claim. So what happened here is wind, hail? Wind and hail. You see a tree stump. Yeah. And then it kind of hit the corner of the house. And then it had a couple hail storms on it, so they decided. And this was a referral? This was a referral. Eight out of ten jobs are referrals for us right now. That's how it should be. Well, this job here came from the neighbor referral. Uh, we did that house maybe four years ago, three years ago. I it, like that color. That is Owens Corning Duration Black Sable. I remember it was a year a year ago it was, uh, or two years two ago. Two years ago, it was the color of the year. Color of the year. So my question is, what's what kind of reputation Temco has in this market? Uh, why, why did you laugh? <laughs> you know, it's it, there. Temco is everywhere. Is yeah, it? yeah. You know, is it a builder's grade here? It is a builder's grade here. You know, it's sold at lumber yards. Uh, it is the builder grade. Man, it, it loses granules so fast. You, you know, I can walk up to a roof and see a Tamco shingle and know immediately that it's. 10 years old because I can see the fiberglass and I can see the gutters are full of granules and like downspouts that have just washed away granules from a big store. What about like tight, tight on it? Have you installed those? I have not installed any tight. I have held and felt the tight shingle and they are hard to tear because they have, you know, a fiberglass reinforced across the whole back. I don't know if they changed up their asphalt chemical composition or if they're embedding their gran granules better into the shingle. So I have I don't have any uh, any opinion on type. I'd be excited to see what type how it performs against okay. others. Uh, are they cheaper? Would you give them a second chance that the price is good? Right now in our market, they're actually more expensive than Malarkey Highlander. Oh wow. By four or five dollars a square. So when I'm already feel like I'm getting a really quality shingle for less, you know, there's no reason to offer something that I feel is an inferior product for more. Oh, the best house. Big